Hey guys, it's Jack Pumpkinton here, and today I'm doing a fun little experiment that I've been wanting to do. I was going to do it on the Windsor, but the results I got weren't really as changing various. I feel like with the Windsor, my SG and my pedalboard, I've got this tone that I can't get with any other guitar. So I'm just leaving that. So we're going to do this on the Randall. And now first I'm going to show you what I use this guitar for. Normally, this is a 1965K, and I'm running through a Randall RH200 with my pedal boards, or my pedals, which is a washer distortion that's not on, um, an MXR noise gate not on, um, super overdrive not on, super chorus, which is on, yes. I like to have the chorus on. And then the acoustic simulator, which is on. This is what the, I use this guitar for most of the time, anyway. I knew this, right? Just chord progression stuff that I like, and then I can write. Anyway, that's the tone I normally use this for. Now, the experiment is, can you get a metal tone through a metal amp with a 1960s K? Now these guitars came out before metal wasn't even a genre. Uh, rock wasn't even a full genre yet, I would argue. Well. There was pop rock with like the Beatles had been on, I think, at that point. And then there was rock and roll with Elvis, but this came out in 1965, so it was more towards the blues artists. But I want to see if I can. So we're going to turn off. So far, no pedals on right now. I just turned off the acoustic simulator and the chords. So we're on the second gauge gain channel. Let's see what we can get. This is what it sounds dry. <coughs> So, more still bluesy. Let's add in some overdrive. And I'll turn on the noise gate. So, it has a heavier sound, but it still is going back to the blues tone. Now you might be saying, well, it's because you're only on your neck pickup. Actually, that was the bridge pickup. This is the neck pickup. You might be saying, well, why does it sound the same? Because the person who had this before me wired the switches to not really do much. I just pretty much decoration. It does sometimes turn into a kill switch. Now let's put on a distortion pedal already on a gain two channel of an amp. Add some overdrive. Mm -hmm. 
Well, in my conclusion of the experiment, I don't think it can. I think just A, with the way that the pickups are, it just doesn't work. Now, these pickups are single coil. They're like P90s. Doesn't help that it's permanently stuck on the neck pickup. So, but even with on a distortion, on a gain channel, It doesn't really do good with a metal tone, and it shouldn't. It's that's not what it was made for. But if I'm on my clean channel, and add some overdrive, it sounds great. Hope you guys like.